Micro Mate in Lock 3mm Connector System, Tyco Electronics. Welcome to this training module on Micro Mate in Lock 3mm Connector System. This training module covers the performance and requirements for the application of the Micro Mate in Lock Connector family. The connector has an integral positive latching housing to prevent connector unmating. The polarized housings help to prevent connector mismating. The connector utilizes standard micro mate and lock contacts. The side latch design allows for an ultra low profile. The micro mate and lock 3mm connector system is a wire to wire and wire to board connector system with contacts on a 3 mm center line. Both single row and dual row configurations are available. Crimp, snap in pin, and receptacle contacts are used to terminate 24 to 20 and 30 to 26 American wire, wire gauge wire. Plug and receptacle housings allow wire to wire and wire to panel configurations. Header assemblies for wire to board interconnections include vertical and right angle components. IR reflow process compatible headers are available in through hole and surface mount configurations. Typical uses of the micro mate and lock 3mm connector system include appliances, instrumentation, industrial machinery, home equipment, security systems, and LED lighting applications. Here shows the micro mate and lock connectors for wire to wire and wire to panel applications. And here shows the micro mate and lock connectors for wire to board applications. The contacts are available in loose piece for terminating with manual handheld tools and in strip form for terminating with semi-automatic or automatic electrically powered machines. The contacts have locking lances that will engage the housing retention shoulder in either contact orientation and prevent backing out during mating of the connector. Receptacle contacts are for use with receptacle housings only. Do not insert receptacle contacts into plug housings. Plug contacts are for use with plug housings only. Do not insert plug contacts into receptacle housings. The receptacle housings are available for panel mount, free hanging wire to wire, and wire to board applications. The receptacle housings accept only micro mate and lock receptacle contact sizes for 30 to 26 or 24 to 20 American wire gauge wire. They are made of flame retardant black thermoplastic. To ensure proper placement, the contact orientation barrel aligns with an orientation feature on the receptacle contact cavity. The contact must be inserted into the housing contact cavity and snapped into place. When fully inserted, the contact locking lance will engage the receptacle's contact retention shoulder and prevent backing out during mating of the connectors. The plug housings are available for panel mount or free hanging wire to wire applications. The plug housing accepts only micro made in lock plug contact sizes for 30 to 26 or 24 to 20 American wire gauge wire. The plug contact can be inserted into the plug housing in one of two orientations 180 degrees opposite of each other. 
The pin header is available for wire to board applications in vertical or right angle configurations for through hole mount applications or surface mount technology applications. The pin header contains pre installed solder type contacts with precision formed solder tines. The pin header is available with integral board locks or surface mount board locks. These board locks provide stability for connector placement on the printed circuit board. The connectors are placed on the printed circuit board by hand or electrically powered machines. The pin header housings are made of flame retardant high temperature black thermoplastic to facilitate the soldering process. The mechanical board locks are made of phosphor bronze plated with tin and the plastic board locks are made of plastic. The contacts will accept stranded wires sizes 30 through 20 American wire gauge with an insulation diameter of 0 0.89 to 1.53. Proper strip length is necessary to properly insert the wire into the contact. The strip length of the wire is shown in the figure. Reasonable care must be taken not to nick, scrape, or cut any strands during the stripping operation.